1957, and I'm waiting. It's the World Championship game. There is no Super Bowl. It's between Cleveland and Detroit. It's at Detroit. And here's the great Cleveland Browns, and they really were, coached by Paul Brown. You got all legends playing on this football team. Detroit does not beat them. They embarrass them. Luke Carpenter tries to turn the right flank. The Lions all-pro linebacker Joe Schmidt lays low low for a three-yard loss. Joe Schmidt. He imposes his will. And Jim Brown, who's the greatest, had a very bad day. They run him right out of the gym. Which sets up an interception by linebacker Joe Schmidt. Everybody leaves the stadium with one word on their lips, and that's Joe Schmidt. He was drafted low. They spent all their money on a, on a, on a running back. I think his name was Gene Gedman. They had a parade for Gene Gedman. Had a parade downtown Detroit. Here comes our running back. As Joe got off the bus, he goes, what's the parade for? Our new running back. Over the next 13 years, Detroit discovered it had celebrated the wrong arrival. Joe Schmidt, the greatest linebacker to ever play. As he went into pro football, there was no middle linebacker. Luckily, he had been playing that at the University of Pittsburgh. He was uh, cerebral, he was very intelligent. So he was always there making the play before the play got going. I think you have to look at football skills, okay? The intuition about playing football, uh, some of those things you can't teach or diagram. And I think I had that ability. Zeke Bratkowski connects with Willie Gallimore in the right flat. But a vicious tackle by Gary Lowe jars the ball loose. Joe Schmidt picks it up at the 14, dribbles once, and goes in to score for Detroit. He, to me, uh, is the history of the National Football League. For every single play, he spilled his guts. He was playing in a uh, preseason game, no face mask. Takes a heel on the eye, and they rip his eye open. This was the NFL as I remember it. And they give him 22 stitches in the eye at halftime. He says, it's a preseason game. This game doesn't count. The coach came and says, Joe, you will start the second half. And to this day, Joe says, I don't think I can see. And the coach says, just see what you can out of that other eye. And that's how his whole career was played. Joe Schmidt, too small, too slow just the best there ever was.